my experience here at the Space Tech Expo has been wonderful. I just got off one of the supply chain panels talking with a group from Department of Defense, NASA, some of industry on the future of some of the issues we're seeing in supply chain and global development of the aerospace industry. The U.S. space industry is currently built on a very large international supply chain, and that supply chain has been stressed, especially over the last 24 months. Us as an early stage investment firm with Embedded Ventures, we've been very excited to help fund and back founders who are looking at alternatives in the supply chain, alternatives in vertically integrated companies or even manufacturing and supply chain development that has domestic alternatives. And, and discussing that with the rest of the panelists was a very valuable experience on their perspectives from different corporate and government entities. Uh, for young engineers uh, or young students that are looking to become engineers, um, I was one of them as well. I'm an engineering student. I've gone from engineer to founder to investor over the last decade. And, and what I'd really encourage to them is if they want a breakthrough career in STEM and engineering or any related sector is to really find a hands-on experience that they can learn, train themselves and differentiate from the rest of the, the student base. It's something that most students have the same exact, you know, perhaps high GPA background that's not something that'll get you highlighted by a top tier startup or train you to become a founder someday. And those experiences will really differentiate you from everyone else that has you know, either a top tier GPA or equivalent academic credentials. The developments within the US space industry that excite me the most right now and is really an expansion beyond rocket launch. We've seen for the last 20 years, commercial rocket launch become reality. It's almost becoming boring to see a rocket launch and land. It's becoming a regular activity, which is something we dreamed of you know, 10 years ago, 20 years ago. And in the areas that we're excited about are the things that are gonna be in the news and the press when rocket launch becomes boring. Rocket launch becomes as regular as flying a plane. Uh, but you see very little investment activity in those areas today, and that's where we lean into is to make those areas exist that no one else is thinking about right now.